You guys all set? Thanks to you, you badass. Okay, streets are kind of a maze, so stay close. So now, where are we headed? To pick up your IDs. There's no way to get topside without them. But I thought TJ was getting our high Ds. What happened with that? He is, but those are different. It takes more than one ID, or even two, to survive in this town. Don't forget, Midgar was built by Shinra for Shinra. Those tyrants! Put the claws away, boss. At least while we're in Shinra territory. Whoa! So Yuffie, what do you think of the Undercity? Way too crowded, I can't stand it. Ugh, the stench! How can anyone live here? I can't agree with you about the smell, but you get used to it quick enough. And the crowds stop bothering you eventually. The place can grow on you if you give it a chance. Uh, wait a second. Are you actually saying you like it here? I thought you hated it. Midgar isn't the enemy. Shinra is. I know W's don't really see the distinction, but... We do. Then what was that stuff on the news? About a reactor blowing up and all. No way that was an accident. It had to be Avalanche. Shh. Sorry. Uh, what's up? Those guys there are from the Splinter Cell. Splinter Cell? They used to be with Avalanche, but left after a policy dispute. Hmm? Well, look who it is. Loving your work. So how many reactors is that now? Wait. Where's Cloud? We lost him. You what? He will be okay though, right? Well, of course he will. A little fall ain't gonna stop a hard ass like him. He'll come swaggering back before long, you mark my words. Yeah, I guess he will. Now, can we talk about President Shithead? Spouting all that crap about us? That lying son of a bitch! Working for Wu Tai! Avalanche ain't nobody! Barrett! <sighs> Speaking of sons of bitches, I heard that Walmart's very own Don Corneo has his stooges out looking for you. Huh? Is that so? Don't got time for no low level mobsters. We got Shinra in our sights. <laughs> You and I both know this is far from over, right? Might as well get some rest while we still can. Right. Hmm. You know what? I think I am gonna look into this. Good luck out there. They're the ones who blew up the reactors. Cool. Should we say hi? No, better not. After what they've done, you gotta assume Shinra's on their tail. Should keep our distance. Yeah, my thoughts exactly. <laughs> Cell, they couldn't care less about collateral damage, long as Shinra goes down. So what's wrong with that? Sounds good to me. We're not out to blow Midgar up or tear it down. We want to save it from Shinra. Look around. Nine out of ten of the people living here are innocent bystanders. We can't level their home to take down one company. Well, that... Company almost leveled our home. And they've got to learn their lesson. Yeah, I get that. Gotta admit, I'm surprised you agreed to work with us. We're just doing what we think is necessary to build a brighter future. That's all there is to it. In other words, you're working with us so we don't work with your old buddies. Knowing what would happen if we did. Uh, can we table this for later, maybe? Not sure now's the best time for heavy topics. Yeah, couldn't agree more. Consider it tabled.
So, what exactly does this ultimate materia do? I'm guessing you have big plans for it? Like after we steal it? Well, the more materia you have, the stronger you are, right? So once we've got the ultimate materia, we'll be stronger than anyone. I guess you will. <laughs> it's gonna be awesome! And not just that. By sneaking into Shinra HQ and snatching their most prized possession from under their noses, not only will we deal a massive blow to their morale, but we'll prove to them that while Wu Tai might be down, we're not out. Is that the gist of it, boss? It sure is! <laughs> See that one? <laughs> well, hello there, hot stuff. How'd you like a shot at the big time? <laughs> Those looks I guarantee you're golden. <laughs> so what do you say? Ready to be queen of the Undercity? Hey! What am I? Chopped liver? <laughs> Kid doesn't need to hear this. You'll be a good girl and cover your ears, okay? You'd be living and working in the most luxurious residence in all you of the world. You want me to be one of Cornelia's brides, is that it? Which makes you a person of influence, right? Oh, so you know your stuff. But I'd say I'm more of a helping hand. So why don't you help me help you? <laughs> Let's get going. What are you doing? Get your hands <laughs> off me! Now don't go playing hard. <laughs> <laughs> Kids who can do that? No, you don't, because I'm an adult. <laughs> also, I'm pretty hot stuff myself, thank you very much. <laughs> sure, whatever helps you sleep at night, little girl. But if you want to pull up a seat at the grown ups table, <laughs> be my guest. <laughs> Gone again, fully wrecked at the Happy Turtle! Get blind drunk at the happy turtle! Girl, get inside, find a seat and order something strong! I'm just getting started! Took it till your brain goes numb! Flick yourself, slip on top of the kill, fear to the whip Those hearts, you smug piece of shit. Boss, huh? boss, you're not gonna believe this. The hottie of the century just fell right into our lap. She did? <laughs> Goods under the hood, junk in the trunk, oh, and down for a bumpy ride. Uh... Sorry, ladies, but after careful consideration, <laughs> we've decided to go with a more qualified applicant. Let's go! See you around. <laughs> okay. So who were those creeps anyway? Don Corneo's talent scouts. They'll say and do just about anything to get unsuspecting girls back to the Don's mansion. I thought it looked seedy. Guess you'd have to be a scumbag to build a place like that. Oh uh ho! -huh. And how do you know what it looks like? I saw it while I was scouting the area. Yuffie, where are you going? 